Welcome to another J Crazy News Headlines and a special Sunday afternoon those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, do you realize that most of the crimes and the murders in Jamaica are based on reprisals? Yeah man, this year alone, you have seen so many murders and based on background checks, most of them, many of them, are because of a killing that took place before and the persons, relatives or friends came back to the life of somebody who they are beefing with or have a confrontation or an altercation with months ago or a year before and it continues and it continues my viewers and my subscribers Reprisal is a big brother problem as to why crime and violence is spiraling out of control in Jamaica because Jamaicans believe say if you take one of my family through violence I'm gonna take one of yours. Or you kill my friend, you go back and kill your friend. Kill my relative, you kill your relative. And it goes on and on and on again. That's one of the major root cause that is causing major conflict. And sometimes, you know, people, these conflict, you know, over simple things, you know, land dispute, family dispute, house dispute, will dispute, it's between relatives. Between cousins, aunties, niece, uncles, nephews, mother, son, father, daughter, you name it. It's a whole mixture of dispute in Jamaica that causes reprisal. You remember you saw in Clarendon last year where a son and a father was dispute over land. And the son was killed first and then the father and the mother was taken out the following day. So to my viewers and my subscribers, reprisal are a major factor as to why Jamaica's crime rate is spiraling out of control. Now you know that Jamaica or Jamaicans believe in an eye for an eye. Your yeah, man, they strongly believe in an eye for an eye. Revenge for revenge. Reprisal for reprisals. And these killings back and forth reprisals can go from one generation to the next for many years back and forth continuously until the whole family on both sides has died out and if there's a new blood that blood come up and know about the history of the reprisals and then the reprisal start back again the attack on rivals brother family members relatives start back again can the police stop it no they can talk to the family members who are in conflicts, persons who are in conflicts. But you know most times Jamaicans do that here. Them had a hearing. Them say you kill my family, you have to dead back. And it goes on and on again. So you can't really blame the government, you know, or the police, you blame the persons who are doing these reprisals, who are making up their mind to take out the life of each other. Now, that's the same case which happened in Westmoreland yesterday at a wedding where three persons were shot, one fatal, who is Rashima Senior. Yeah man, Rashima Senior was slaughtered at that wedding reception. Now, this killing has to do with a feud which took place a month ago. Yeah man, you'll hear about it right now my viewers and my subscribers. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, on the screen right now is the late deceased Rashima Senior, aka Rush, who was killed in that deadly attack at that wedding reception at the Shields Hotel in Nigri Westmoreland, my viewers and my subscribers. Based on information around 6 15 pm, they're at the wedding reception when a lone gunman, a hitman to be exact, pulled up on a motorcycle. And my viewers and my subscribers, that gunman walked closer to the beach where reception was keeping my viewers and my subscribers. That gunman Point his gun to the direction of the people who was in, it, in attendance. He fired several shots hitting three persons, two cameramen, and also Roshima Senior. Unfortunately, my viewers and my subscribers, Miss Senior did not make it. She died at the hospital, my viewers and my subscribers. Now I hear persons saying on social media that what could Roshima do to deserve such a brutal death? First and foremost, she wasn't the target. She was murdered innocently, my viewers and my subscribers. She was there, participating in the wedding, and she was murdered innocently. 
by the lone gunman. Roshima Sr. wasn't the target. One of the cameraman was the target, my viewers and my subscribers. Unfortunately, she died. And right now, he's in hospital nursing gunshot wounds. Thank God he's still alive. But sad to say, Roshima Sr. did not make it, which is very unfortunate. Now, what has transpired is that a fire member of Mrs. Paulette Baker Frame took out a hit on one of the cameramen. Remember Miss Paulette? She was murdered at Cousins Cove last month while coming from church. Our brother dropped her off, our brother drove off, and he heard gunshot wounds. He reversed the car, went back, and he found Miss Paulette lying in a pool of blood. Remember, you know, Miss Paulette Baker Frame had a dispute with a lady and was in court over land, my viewers and my subscribers, that allegedly our mother died left in the carry lady but mrs paul and the lady had this agreement remember you know that gunman came to kill mrs paulette baker frame no a fan member say in Argoso, somebody have a dead back for mrs paulette baker frame so one of the cameraman at that wedding yesterday was a close relative of the woman she had a dispute with over that so that hitman slash gunman went he was paid he went to take out the cameraman but unfortunately three persons were hit and Roshima senior was murdered she wasn't the target of that shooting incident at the wedding reception in Nigel yesterday but one of the cameraman my viewers and my subscribers may I tell the people tell about reprisals reprisals are taking a lot of lives in Jamaica and sometimes persons who are innocent are being murdered because of conflicts that keeps going on and on again. Just pray that this killing don't spark a reprisal for the death and the murder of Roshima Senior. This is J. Craig's News once again. Until then, have a blessed and safe Sunday afternoon. Yeah man, I'm here to see a black legend. I'm here to represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy not play when he review the thing. Then Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy not play when he review the thing. Then. Review the thing, them review the thing, them. Check crazy. Reviewing news, entertainment, and celebrity lifestyle. Review the thing, them review the thing, them. Check crazy.